Alright guys, welcome to the last episode of Castle Miner Z, at least for this version anyway. Uh, this is going to be a bit, I, this is probably going to be very short, because we're going to go into creative, because I really do want to show you guys, um, uh, we can fly. How do we fly? How do I fly? Options, controls. F. Alright, so we're gonna fly. Uh where's spawn? Spawn is right here. So we'll fly right in that direction. Alright guys, so we're gonna go to this area which is three thousand blocks away from spawn. And three thousand blocks away from spawn is amazing and I'll show you guys why when we get there. So, 3,000 blocks away from spawn. Now, I'll, I'll shut up. We, we can, I'll talk, we'll just talk about stuff until we get there. So, anyway, guys. Hope you guys are enjoying the Castle Miner Z series, because I certainly am. Not that many of you are watching. Each of these videos is probably getting, like, what, five views? Um, yeah. Anyway, as I was saying, uh, what I'm planning to do is this will be the last episode for Castle Miner Z. And then I'm going to do the classic version, and then the classic version with friends. I'm not going to do um, this version with friends, because the classic version is just much more fun. But, um, yeah. In terms of like what I've got planned for the channel, uh, I'm thinking of doing one more Fortnite video until I completely give up Fortnite videos. Um, I'm going to start streaming on Twitch soon, so go. I'll leave the link to my Twitch in the description below. Uh, um, nah, I probably won't leave the, if you don't see the link in the description below, it's probably because I'm just too lazy. So we're halfway there. It's pretty good. Uh, I don't know why F is the flying key, but, uh, each to its own, I guess. Uh, we can build freely, I believe. Yes. Uh, let's just test out a normal RPG, because we didn't get to try one of those last game. Uh, here we go, normal RPG. Do we fly? Do we go faster than the actual rocket? I think we go faster than the actual rocket. Okay, well that was an RPG. Now, uh, what else do we have in here? The laser assault rifle, what we did. Yeah, we didn't get to try this out. We didn't get to try that out, the laser assault rifle. Our original world. We'll try it out in the classic version. <laughs> How about that? Um, I'm going to be trying to earn achievements in the classic version. We will be playing on, at, like, with enemies on at the start of the game. So we'll try and earn every single achievement. So the classic version probably run a little bit longer than this version. But yeah, okay, we're almost there, guys. Oh, alien crater. Great. Alien crater is going to be useless because 3,000 blocks. Away from spawn lies an area of. That's right, infinite ore. And uh, it's infinite ore. It might not sound too good, but infinite ore is actually. V it, 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 <laughs> you might think you have to go deep into the infinite ore world to find like a good um, like a anything actually good. No, you don't. Literally, we'll try and find some. Like on the on the top, you will find. Let's try and find some. I think you have to go further out into the world because maybe you do have to go a little bit deep. Okay, I saw some diamonds. Yes, you can literally find infinite diamonds in this world. Same with iron. Same with gold. Same with everything else. In fact. Things like gold and iron you find in larger chunks, and it's the exact same with diamonds. Now that diamond was in a one, but you don't have to go too far. Now about three thousand four hundred blocks, I'd like to say, away from spawn, you will find only bloodstone. So you can't go too far out. The stone land is pretty small, but like it, like I said, gives you infinite diamonds basically. Um. So yeah, 
I was hoping to do this in the endurance video, but the zombies were just like, nah, bro. I ain't doing that. Now, in terms of suspicions, saying that I used um, this land to get all those diamonds, I did not, okay? I did not use this place to get all the diamonds. What I did was I just, like, I went, I just found every diamond I could within a thousand blocks of my house. And that was, it was, it took a long, long time, let's say about six hours of mining. Because uh, there was these, these times where I got really lucky and found like five diamonds in one spot. But yeah, here's the infinite ore land. About, ah, look at this, a lucky block. Let's try this out. Because this is, this gives you better stuff than the normal ones. Bloodstone pickaxe, bloodstone pistol, and space rock. Jesus Christ. Imagine if we found one of those in the first episode and we opened it up and we got that. That would be insane. You know, that normal doors. Of course, now that you guys have seen the lucky loot block, th 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 those are basically useless. Um, but they're very rare. And as I say that, I see three. All right, let's open these up. See what he gives us. Uh, laser bullets, or rocket launcher, and bloodstone. Uh, bloodstone pistol, C4, and a sticky grenade. And diamond bullets and a diamond pickaxe. So yeah, they are. They give you a lot of good stuff, but like I said, they are rare. Uh, again, we just find one straight away. Uh, diamond pickaxe, a laser rifle, and a sticky grenade. Mm. Here's a monster spawner. Come at me, bros. Can you mind? This mine's <laughs> it's very fast, but anyway, this has been the uh, infinite all land, uh, and I believe it'll get to a certain. I th I think you have to go to that bloodstone area, like this, the um, just the infinite bloodstone area, because I think that's where the dragon might be. I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, so this has been Castle Miner Z. Hope you guys have enjoyed this series. Uh, I will be rebooting it soon on the classic version. Because I've, I've said that multiple times. And if you guys haven't been listening, well, you've been quite rude. <sighs> um, I believe at some point, like, at some distance, it is just infinite lanterns. Which sounds pretty useless, and it is. And then after the lanterns, it's just more lanterns. The lanterns is where it ends with the whole infinite stuff. But yeah, thank you guys for watching this episode. Um, I'll probably call it Castle Miner Z bonus, because it's a bonus. We'll probably go here in the classic version and just mine really like everything. Uh, if I figure out how to use OBS, I'll probably stream it. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you in the next video.